What madness! Going into the Deadlands, to Mehrun's Dagon's own roost, to spit in his eye. And they survived! Bring not upon the Let's hit the trail! Few Crack Dagons! This place is amazing! This place is incredible! Investigator Vale never went to Oblivion in any of her stories, so I wasn't sure what to expect. A lot of crazy talk about conquest, Mayrune's day gone, and staining the world with the blood of their enemies, but nothing more about the ambitions. Yeah, sorry. I know Lyrinth was counting on me to come up with some clue to follow. I thought mostly helping out around Leowin, and I did a couple of small tasks for Governor Keshu. Rounding up she gave me the highlights. Weird Cataclyst devices, Sister Seldina, that evil Knockbras guy. She sent one of her creepy followers to bring me messages. That Rogatina woman. Letters mostly, but Lirinth did stop by to give me... The Longhouse documents were no help, and I still haven't heard any word from my contacts. Our next chance can be found at the House of Winners. The House of Winners? That sounds intriguing. Meet me at the House of Winners. It's time to explore the Anchorite's memories. Mayrun's Dagon was particularly interested in you at Ardent Hope. We must examine your memories. So you're the Anchorite, huh? Neat mask. Thanks. I like your bow, too. Let us begin. Mortal, use the memory vessel to capture fragments of the Anchorite. Use the vessel to collect the memory fragments when they appear. I will use the Anchorite's amulet as a focus. <laughs> This is supposed to hurt. There, a memory fragment. Take it. Chief Mickle, the legacy of the Longhouse Emperors flows through her veins. Keep going. We are close. Another memory fragment. Take it before it disperses. mortals you try my patience the anchorite's memories are too scattered unfocused she ah this is a very early memory another early memory but this time her father's voice is cold commanding if you find the emperor you can talk to him get the information you need directly from Morakar himself. As I understand it, the amulet was a gift from father to daughter. It...
Don't just stand there, Scamfoot. Hide! Get down! I like to think fate puts us in dark places because it's our job to be a light there. some sort of forge. I wonder if it still works. Free us, mortal, now! Did you hear that? It sounded like it came from the fur. The furnace door is sealed tight. Why would my amulet lead us here? Open the door. Your Emperor commands it. The same voice from my memory. Emperor Morica. There's a discharge labrum there. We need to find and charge some lucents. The door opened. <clears throat> All I see is a chunk of slag. There's no doubt about it. The voice came out of that chunk of slag. You've seen this place. It's all about torture. I think they fused the souls of the Emperors into that chunk of metal. We need to ignite the furnace to melt the slag. There are two other discharge labrums. If we can find another Lucent, we might... Look, up there! A Lucent! Place the charged Lucent in that discharge labrum by the wall. Over here, there's a dynamis font. Let's charge that lucent. That worked! The lucent is charged. Now place it in one of the discharge labrums. We thank for our freedom. This is not freedom. No, simply a respite from the darkness. I am Leovic, last of the Longhouse Emperors. But who are you? you have... It started with my grandfather. But it was my father who passed the responsibility to me. I took action. I moved the ambitions to new vaults. Safe. Vaults. But before I could... I still taste the blood of my enemies. Those I crushed beneath my heel. Has the mortal world already forgotten the name of Durkarach, the Black Drake? First of the Longhouse Emperors. The plan was mine. Mine! Lies. You have the tongue of a liar, and I will... An eternity of agony. This was not what the Prince of Destruction promised. 
I did. <laughs> Daughter? You mean the weapon. Why have you brought her here? You can't... You did not know? The girl is one of the four ambitions of Merun's Dagon. So she... An emperor never relies on a single strategy. We were... My daughter, the fourth ambition. She's the key. Along with the other ambitions, she can call forth the power to banish Merun's Dagon. The Anchorite? Is that what you call Moraid? Ha! <sighs> Use her. Her... I'm an ambition? One of those people Lyrinth was talking about? How is that possible? We are not property or playthings, Morokar. Sombrin, no! You are what we created you to be. You wanted a weapon? Then taste my power! Sombrin, why? I almost decided not to accompany Lyrinth, but now I'm glad she insisted. How else would I have gotten the opportunity to punish the Longhouse Emperors for what they did to us? I have no interest in more of their lies. And neither should you. I... Those men were evil when they were alive. Do you think an existence of torture in the Deadlands would change that? A fantasy. We can't hope to stand against the Prince of Destruction. Look. I... I didn't think Sombrim was going to do something so... dramatic. I'm not sure how else to describe it. When we first arrived in the Deadlands, he insisted he could help me control my powers. That I... He spends most of his time reading that strange book. So you must remember, the book Evely gave him, Lirinth called it the Mysterium Xarxis. Not in the same way. I don't think he's having dreams or anything. I've tried, but he wants to protect me. That man... Sombrin, he seems familiar. Maybe. But familiar or not, they're still strangers. Right. Morikar said the answers were waiting at the Isle of Joys. I am, I am not all right with what just happened. Lyrinth and I managed to find Sombrin and Kalia. We convinced them to come with us. That's just... Did you have any idea? Wait a moment. I know that name. Remember Lyrinth had me comb through the Longhouse Emperor's documents? That's why the map didn't make sense. It wasn't a map of Tamriel. It's the Deadlands. You're one of us, Anchorite. An ambition. Do you know what that means? I don't know a lot of things, it seems. I can answer your questions. Come with us. To a place meant only for ambitions. I'll show you. No. We need to stay together. I'm sorry, Lyrinth. I need to do this. Damn it. That was a mistake that may cost us dearly. Mortals. Always so unpredictable. No. And his erratic behavior worries me. Mortal minds were not meant to read the Mysterium Xarxes. My reaction is irrelevant. The Anchorite recently had her memories returned to her and has yet to make sense of them all. Have you not realized after all this time that I have my ways, little mortal? If I were the Anchorite, I'd want answers too. As much as I want to, no. Someone has to investigate the Isle of Joys. We should... Good to hear. I bet.
here's a sight. What do you make of this? That's the island over there. This portal should get us across. Ruins. This must be the Isle of Joys. Ego Mimic? What's that? Practice makes the master. All right, this was a productive trip. At least Emperor Morakar's ghost didn't lie about leaving stuff here. Let yeah, I noticed that straight away. Maybe they were part of a set, and this one was Emperor Morakar's? Let me see. The Ego Nimic is some sort of name? Didn't we explore all the vaults in Blackwood? Wait a moment. I did read about one other vault. Doom Vault Vulpanaz. Really? You explored another vault without me? Hmm, I guess if you'd found the key to a weapon... Well, we can't give up now. Our steel.
You're here! Let's find the spot indicated on the map. <laughs> what happened to this place? Those runes are similar to the ones on the ring. I knew that ring was important. All right. Is this where the anchorite used to live? Looks like someone else has been here recently. diary. I guess he and Kalia spent some time here. Did he write down... So Sombrin and Kalia came here at some point, after they left us and went to the Deadlands? Hmm. He's not on the same level as the writer of the Investigator Vale stories, but his writing isn't bad. Hey now, positive thoughts! This enchantment looks powerful. That's... unusual. I have absolutely no idea what that is. Mortal. That fool ambition. He will ruin everything. You both need to come with me. Sombra, how clear must I make it, little mortal? He has Kalia and the Anchorite and is attempting to force them to go with him. When I left to retrieve you, Sombra was attempting to wrestle power from each of the other ambitions and take it for himself. I'm finally getting used to them. As before, the properties of this accursed mountain play havoc with my magic. Better if you make your own way from here. Sombrin. Must run all the way up this thing. Over here, mortal. Sombrin took Kalia and the Anchorite through that door. Sombrin, stop! This is insane. We're not coming with you. Meirut's Dagon can teach us, help us control our powers. It's all in his book. I can't let you interfere. Destron, deal with them. 
Death Shark? Sovereign, what have you done? I must obey. Death You will not pass. Forth. Let my memories destroy them. You let me die. and didn't expect you to fight back, Anchorite. Well done. Wh what did I just do? We should go, too. I will summon a portal to take us to Fargrave. I didn't know I could do that. Open a portal out of thin air. I... I'm not sure. I just... and the Anchorite will be safe here. Come, little mortal. Let's talk. I did not expect Sombran to turn against us, or for him to try to take the power of the remaining ambitions. He now possesses the power of Destron and Kalia as well as his own. If he hands that power to Dagon, neither of us will like the results. I am still considering our options. At least we have the Anchorite, and she still has her powers. That is enough for now. You did well, mortal. Against all odds, you continue to prevail. Now that we can confer in the relative safety of Madame Wim's establishment, tell me what you discovered on the Isle of Joys. Let me see the documents you found. I am familiar with Nimix, but not this Ego Nimic. Interesting. And you found this in the vault? Our best hope lies in the Anchorite now. Simply put, a Nimic is a Daedra's true name. Some of us have many, others only one. If a... It's just one thing after another, isn't it? I've barely had time to process the fact that I'm an ambition, or even learn what that really means. I had a vault? Yes. I remember something about a place where they put me when I was being trained by Sister Seldina. And I better remember what it is and how to use it, right? Meirun's Dagon provided parts of himself to create the four ambitions. These parts make up his egonymic and give the ambitions their power. The egonymic can be used to weaken Dagon, to compel him back to oblivion should the need to do so arise. All four parts of the Egonymic must be used to even attempt this course of action. We will only use it as a last resort. I... I know this. A low and constant hum at the back of my mind. A part of me, but also a part of something else. I think that's how we recognized each other, Sombran and me. So, the Longhouse Emperors were not as reckless as I thought. Mortal, I have an idea. As I surmised, the Ego Nimic is a more powerful version of a Nimic. Perhaps only the princes have them, since I never heard of them before. Sombrin was able to take Kalia's power. His summoning of Destron's spirit at the summit suggests he also has Destron somehow, as well as his own. Oh, not me, little mortal. The Anchorite. She's the fourth ambition. If Sombran truly seeks Dagon, then he's heading for the prince's capital, Destruction Solace. Who else but Aerox the Mutilator? 
The Daedrat was once Mehrunes Dagon's most powerful general. He must have visited the city multiple times over the centuries. And while you track down Aerox, I will gather what allies I can. We will need more... Daedrash will be punished for this transgression. That little beast killed my guard and nearly bit my ear off. And it talked! They aren't supposed to do that! My master, Nifizan, the shadow that screams eternal, will not be pleased. Perhaps you've heard of him? This matter does not concern you, mortal. The Daedrat will be dealt with soon enough. This creature is your pet. He killed the mortal of a very prominent Daedra. I... The stricture recognizes the destruction of Daedric property as a crime. But since the only loss was a mortal life, this compensation is adequate. The Daedra is free to go. Thank you for freeing me again, mortal master. I shall shred the anchors of your foes once more. You wish to challenge Mehrunes Dagon in his own city? Oh, very much so. Aerox has been there many times. You can count on your faithful servant. It will be my honor to fight alongside you once more. Let us make haste, Master. <laughs> <laughs> 